pace. And that's really what we're talking about, isn't it? In a perfect world, I want you to incubate investors every day. The reality is you'll often do it when it's acute. And only then with that pain will you there go, OK, I better put this as part of my work. So one of the things we do is we put in my... Well, actually, I don't talk... <laughs> I don't talk to investors anymore. Um, it's now moved to the team. But when we, when, when we were fundraising, we had green spots. So green for investors, yellow for mentoring, because they're fun colors. Blue for strategy. My diary is mainly blue now, which is about working with the team, working with our finance director, working with my mentor, working on the business. You know, the classic move from working in your business to working on your business. But when I was um, really running <coughs> the fundraising side along with Ash delivering the deals and the team delivering, um, I had spots in my diary for investors to work so it wasn't like oh I just forgot to call an investor I had like two o'clock till four o'clock three times a week that I had to pick up the phone and talk to investors make sure the relationship fits it's an obvious one but don't squeeze a quart into a pint pot don't squeeze a, a, a what's a peg into a round hole yeah you know, square peg into a round hole just make sure it fits because you know you're going to be driving a bus together for quite a while make sure it's a comfortable ride Give them options on both sides. I don't mean give them lots of options where you could do this, 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 or this. But for us, the options would be, or would have been, you can buy deals from us, you can joint venture with me, or you can lend me money. Those are the three options by which you can generate good cash from my work. It's fairly clear, fairly simple. You choose which option you want to do. Of course, option number four is you don't need to do anything. That's okay. Remember, one and two say yes, one and two say no. And then understand their objectives. We talked at, at length about objective yesterday. Not just I want to make 20 grand or 50 grand or 100 grand, but really what you want to do. Is it sending the grandchildren to a fee-paying school or buying a, a, a fancy car or you know, getting a holiday home? And how much will that cost? You know, what are their real objectives? And be very clear about the process. This is one of the things. Do you remember, Jonathan, when you had your... Junkie, junkie investor, your prima donna, your junkie, uh, uh, and I've, I have, I had one of them too, um, and you were feeling that very strongly this investor was um, a prima donna and was telling you how high to jump. It was about a year, year and a half ago. We got you up here to present, yeah. and I was, I wouldn't say brutal, but I was like, I don't get your pitch. I don't get it. I don't get it. No, you're pretty harsh. Yeah, it's, it's good, <laughs> I was pretty it's harsh. Really useful because why can't you this because I know that I like to stand up with a board guy, but um, I learned from it. Yeah. And, and this whole mentoring has totally transformed my ability to raise joint venture. Yes. Um, I'm just emailing my best mate to say yes, please. Oh, so he might raise £550,000 in the room today. That Guys, there's a competition going on. It looks like he's almost about to take the lead. Da -da 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 -da. <laughs> but when we had you up here, um, I was going, I don't get it, I don't get it, I don't get it. Because like you guys in the room yesterday pitching to each other, um, wh wh where are you? That were Dean, you were saying, I don't want to do the waffle. Um, I don't mean this with any rudeness at all. Jonathan went straight into the detail, and I'm like, mate, I don't get it. Because I want, you know, Neanderthal, tell me what's in it for me. He wasn't doing that. And we had you clean up your pitch four, five, six times, that was on the Sunday, and by Thursday, you'd raised 700,000. And I think it's just because you got the clarity, right, I offered this. Whereas at first, you wanted all the explanation, almost almost the justification. Be clean, be clear. And that really... Yes, you were. <laughs> no. would, would, you, would you possibly like to make some money? I mean, if you're sure about your stuff, they're going to make a lot of money, which is wonderful. He did make a shed load of money. Back and again, but I, Un yes. I have ignored him. But He's on the naughty step. Um, I, I just can't face it. The grief and, and the lack of respect. Oh, don't. Don't. He either goes in a naughty step on a t for three months and it's cold and it's a little stone step and then he comes back in behaviour repaired or you, you simply replace him. Jonathan, you're going places. He's <coughs> completely replaceable. So clarity of process is very important and that is what I hope you got out of the exercise yesterday.